أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم dear viewers welcome back to jamil tv we are going to take an overview of surah number 95 attain meaning the fig let us start from surah's introduction there are eight verses in this surah and it is at serial number 95 in the compilation of holy quran the essential fact of the surah is embodied in the verses we indeed have created man in the finest form when we brought him down to the lowest of low except for those who believe and do good deeds for there shall be an unfailing recompense verses 4 to 6 refer how surah gets its name This surah takes its name after the first ayat A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem Wattini wa zhaitoon By the fig and the olive The word fig only appears in this surah and nowhere else in the Quran Period of revelation according to Qatada radhiallahu anhu This surah is Madinan two different views have been reported from ibn abbas radhiyallahu anhu first that it is a makkan surah and second that it is madinan but the majority of scholars regard it as makkan revelation a manifest symbol of which is the use of the word this city of peace hazal baladil amin for makkah central theme its theme is the re- rewards and punishments of the hereafter for this purpose was swearing on oath by the habitants of some illustrious prophets it has been stated that god has created man in the most excellent molds although at other places in the quran this truth has been expressed in different ways for example at some places it has been said god appointed man his vice gerent on the earth and commanded the angels to bow down to him surah al baqara sikha 30 to 34 verses refer surah 6 al anam the grazing like stock 165 surah Seven Al Araf, the elevation, verse eleven, Surah fifteen, Al Hijr, the valley of stone, verses twenty eight, twenty nine, Surah twenty seven, An Nawal, the arch, sixty two, add others that man has become bearer of the divine trust which the earth. and the heavens and the mountains did not have the power to bear surah 33 al ahzab the confederates 72 verse and at still others that and we have uh, certainly honored the children of adam and carried them on the land and sea and provided for them of the good day things and preferred them over much of what we have created with definite preference surah 17 al isra the night journey verse 70 so first yet there the statement made an oath in particular by the habitants of the prophets alayhi salam that man has been created in the finest of molds signifies that mankind has been blessed with such an excellent mold and nature that it gave birth to men capable of attaining to the highest positions of prophethood a higher position than which has not been attained by any other creature of allah then it has been stated that there are two kinds of men those who in spite of having been created in the finest of mold become inclined to evil and their moral 
degeneration causes them to be reduced to the lowest of the low and those who by adopting the way of faith and righteousness remain secure from the degeneration and are consistent with the noble position which is the necessary demand of their having been created in the best of molds the existence among mankind of uh, both these kind of uh, men is such a factual thing which no one can deny for it is being observed and experienced in society everywhere at all times in conclusion this factual reality has been used as an argument to prove that when among the people there are these two separate and quite distinct kinds how can one deny the judgment and retribution for deeds if the morally degraded are not punished and the morally pure and exalted are not rewarded and both end in the dust alike it would mean that there is no justice in the kingdom of allah whereas human nature and common sense demand that a judge should do justice how then can one conceive that allah who is the most just of all judges would not do justice the virtues of the surah narrated al barra radhiyallahu anhu that i heard the prophet sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam reciting surah tin wa zaitun 95 by the fig and the olive in the isha prayer and i have never heard anybody with a better voice or recitation than his bukhari hadith number 7546 alhamdulillah we have completed the study of surah may allah bless us with the correct understanding of the teachings of quran and to implement them in our daily life ameen jazakallah thank you very much for